Welcome to Saturday Morning Prayer as we remember Octavius Hadfield, Bishop of New Zealand. God has shone in our hearts to give the light of the knowledge of the glory of God in the face of Jesus Christ. Glory to God, Father, Son and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now and for ever. Amen. The opening canticle, a song of creation. Bless the Lord, all created things, who is worthy to be praised and exalted for ever. Bless the Lord, all people of the earth, who is worthy to be praised and exalted for ever. O people of God, bless the Lord. Bless the Lord, you priests of the Lord. Bless the Lord, you servants of the Lord who is worthy to be praised and exalted for ever. Bless the Lord, all you of upright spirit. Bless the Lord, you that are holy and humble in heart. Bless the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, who is worthy to be praised and exalted for ever. The night has passed and the day lies open before us. Let us pray with one heart and mind. As we rejoice in the gift of this new day, so may the light of your presence, O God, set our hearts on fire with love for you, now and forever. Amen. Our psalm this morning is a portion of Psalm 37, verses 23 to 32. It begins... If your steps are guided by the Lord, and he delights in your way, though you stumble, you shall not fall headlong, for the Lord holds you by the hand. You may wish to pause the video here to complete the remainder of the psalm. Creator God, whose praise and power are proclaimed by the whole creation, receive our morning prayers, we pray, and renew us in your service. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Our reading this morning is from Mark chapter 1, verses 35 to 39. In verse 35 we read, In the morning while it was still very dark, Jesus got up and went out to a deserted place, and there he prayed. You may wish to pause the video here to complete the remainder of the reading. May your word live in us and bear much fruit to your glory. The Canticle, A Song of Redemption Christ is the image of the invisible God, the firstborn of all creation. For in him all things were created, in heaven and on earth, visible and invisible. All things were created through him and for him. He is before all things, and in him all things hold together. He is the head of the body, the church. He is the beginning, the firstborn from the dead. For it pleased God that in him all fullness should dwell, and through him all things be reconciled to himself. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. The Connect for Octavius Hadfield Eternal God, you gave your servant Octavius Hadfield strength out of weakness and faithful love 
to enrich the church in Aotearoa. May we strive for justice and with equal care for all, make known your truth for the glory of your name through Jesus Christ, our Redeemer. Amen. You may wish to pause the video here to say intercessions, prayers and thanksgivings. Lord and Heavenly Father, you have brought us safely to this new day. Keep us by your mighty power. Protect us from sin, guard us from every kind of danger, and in all we do this day, direct us in the fulfilling of your purpose. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you, and also with you. Let us praise the Lord. Thanks be to God. May the peace of God, which passes all understanding, keep our hearts and minds in Christ Jesus. Amen.